Today I'm making hot crust buns. These are one of my favourite things to eat at Easter. They are so easy to make, they do take a little extra time but they are definitely worth waiting for. To start, sift your flour into a big bowl which is big enough for your dough to double in size and then stir in your sugar. Next, sift in your spices and add your salt and yeast and give it another stir. Create a well into the centre of your flour and crack in your one egg. Pour in your warm milk, I just warmed mine in the microwave, followed by your cooled butter and half of the water. Add the grated zest of one orange. Infuse your sultanas and cranberries into the juice of one orange. Next, pour in your mixed peel, the infused sultanas and cranberries with any of the remaining juices and depending on your dough, the rest of the water. Once it started to come together, use your hands to bring it into a ball. Lightly dust your work surface with some flour and give your dough a knead for 5 to 10 minutes. At first your dough will break when stretched as the gluten hasn't bound together yet, so keep kneading the dough until smooth. Once smooth, place it back into your bowl, cover with cling film and leave it to rest in a warm place until it has doubled in size. Because we have the weight of the fruit in our dough, it might take a little longer, so just be patient. My dough took about an hour and a half to double in size. Once it's doubled, punch down the dough and give it a little knead on a floured worktop for two to three minutes. Divide the doughs into 12 equal pieces, roll into balls and place onto a baking tray lined with parchment paper. Preheat your oven to 200 degrees fan. For other temperatures, they'll be listed here. Cup your hand around your dough and roll it against the surface with some pressure to create a nice neat roll. Arrange the buns on the tray with enough space in between for them to double in size and then pop them back into the warm place to double again. For the cross, mix together flour and water and spoon it into a piping bag. Trim off the end of the piping bag, but make sure you don't trim it too much. Start by piping the mixture onto the baking tray and create a line running across the buns and finish by pressing it onto the other side of the baking tray. Repeat the lines but crossing over the other way. Pop them in the oven for 15 to 20 minutes or until they're golden brown on top and they sound hollow when you tap them. While they are still warm from the oven, brush the top with some orange marmalade. To make the glaze, stir some hot water into some orange marmalade. Sift the marmalade and brush it on top of the buns. To serve, I like to cut them in half and spread with some butter. Another favourite of mine and my family's is to toast the hot cross buns. Let me know in the comments below how you like to enjoy yours. So that's hot crust buns, easy. For more videos, subscribe to my channel. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and feel free to leave any requests in the comment box below.